Right, uh, planning committee, 31st of May 2018. Uh, Councillor Tynan, the newly re elected no. chairman. Would you like to just take us to the highlights? Yes, sir. So Thank the, you. Uh, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank the first requirement for the meeting was to elect a chairman and vice chairman, and it resolved that Councillor Tyler would be elected chairman and uh, Councillor Duff vice chairman. Application for consideration, there was five applications for consideration, and I'll quickly go through those. Erection of a single storey detached dwelling at Belmont Gardens, it resolved that the town council believed it, that if it permitted the application would lead to overdevelopment on site. The town council would ask the MC to know that the Royal Town Council had placed a covenant on this land to restrict development on the site to no more than two properties. Erection of a new dwelling at 21 Oak Deep Close. Resolved to reject the application, the committee believed that it permitted this application will lead to overdevelopment on the site. There have been numerous applications on this site and Lawrence Town Council have rejected these on the grounds of overdevelopment. The Town Council continues to believe that it is not possible to sensible accommodate two dwellings on the site, particularly parking arrangements and gardens are extremely cramped. Garage annex with accommodation over, over with the link to the main dwelling at uh, Willow's House at Brook Road, and the council had no objection to that. Demolition of existing dwellings and erect four dwellings with amenity spaces and parking, including modification of existing vehicles, accesses to crossways at One Child Eston Road. Resolved that Lawrence Town Council would comment as follows. Firstly, the Town Council share the view of many local residents who feel that this is disappointing to see the loss of such an historical building in the town. However, on reviewing this particular application, the Town Council will ask that Northamptonshire Highways are asked to comment on the suitability of the access arrangements, in particular the access mm -hmm. onto the busy junction and that of the access drive to the four properties. It's not a dual width. Planning applications granted, ENC granted three applications, all of, all of which Rawns Town and three was also offered no objections. An application for a proposed rock curb at 29 Wellington Road has been withdrawn, although I didn't notice there's some work going on in front of that house, so quite well that's about that um, The committee considered one planning appeal. At Chestnut, uh, at Chestnut Court in Rawlins, to fell a, to, to fell a near ground level that we planted with a silver birch tree. <coughs> exactly the Members reviewed the information on the planning appeal and followed the discussion it was. It resolved that the Town Council would modify their previous comments on and will submit the following comments to the planning inspectorates. The Town Council value TPOs and wish to reinforce their commitment to this. The Town Council do not wish to see the tree cut down, however they agree that the urgent maintenance work is required and a long-term maintenance plan is needed. It is resolved that the, the Aboriginal <coughs> Officer at ENC, Mr Henry Pearson, would be asked to provide members of the Planning Committee with training on tree preservation laws. I think this is a good idea and I think we should draw some, uh, some, some, some value from that. Um, I tend to require not <coughs> planning concern, concerns. I'm thinking about it because I'm, mm -hmm. I'm going off in the minutes as well. So I'm going to be <coughs> Items not required planning consent. Variation to the premises <coughs> license to Rawlins SR Connect London Road Rawlins to extend the hours of sale of alcohol to 24 hours daily and to remove the condition of Annex 2 and replace those with, with, with attached. Uh, at the moment, uh, the license provisions are from 8 to 11 o'clock, I understand it, and they, they wish to uh, impose 12 to 12 from um, licensing on this. Um, I would add that there is some. There, um, there is some, some uh, assets put, put forward by the police already. I think they have to they have to sort of put forward a, a, a camera, camera visual camera on the on the on the premises on the alcohol, and the police are allowed at any time to sort of look at this. So there's a certain provision put, goes within this licence. So <coughs> um, 
public consultation for East North Hants County Tree Management, the ESC have drafted the Tree Management Guide Policy Document and would like to invite you with the opportunity to provide feedback prior to the final document to publish. Members consider the consultancy on the Tree Management Policy and it was agreed that when the policy is finished it will be worth reviewing the Town Council Policy to ensure that in line with the ESC policies and it resolved to review the Town Council Policy when the ESC have finalised their new and finally, Cambridge and Peterborough and Wingwood and Waste Local Plan from preliminary draft consultancy from the City of the Major. Cambridge Cam Cam Council and Peterborough Council are preparing a joint mineral <coughs> waste local plan which will be replaced currently adopt adopted joint plan and is to note, note Cambridge and Peterborough Minerals Waste Plan and draft consultancy. This particular thing is uh, it's, it, will, it takes a three year preparation for this, um, this draft document to come, to come into force. And uh, it is to forecast the future uh, uh, waste needs for the area and to ensure that it uh, that there's enough new <coughs> requirements uh, for the area available for the future developments and housing growth. I don't really think it's going to affect this area too badly. I think we'll probably get the resources in the new own areas. And that concludes the report. Do you have any questions? Can I make a comment? As I had the joy of persuading a Hungarian low driver not to down walk, walk the meadow lane to walk park areas today. Could we possibly rewrite to the post office and ask them to find sort this post? The yellow postcode, and that was where they told them. So, to be fair to the bloke, he didn't speak Hungarian, my Hungarian's not very good, you know. Um, but to be fair to the bloke, I mean, he was following these postcodes. So, can we write to them again and say, can they distinguish Wolf Park as a separate postcode? Please. Yeah, we, we have. I know you haven't. I said again. I said again. Yeah. Sounds, that sounds sensible. Mm. Anything, any, anything else for Councillor Tyrone? No? Oh, we'll have to accept the minutes. Uh, second up, Councillor McDuff. All in favour? Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.